Hi, it's Steve. Here I am at the shop. I've got a uh, an old jubel in my hands, and I'm making a little video of it so that you can hopefully hear what it sounds like, and maybe you might want to come on by and play it and purchase it. You can see a few little flaws in it right there. There's a surface check. It's called a surface check. Um, Actually, it might be a little more than surface check. It's where the seam started to come apart once, and it's been stabilized. It looks fine, actually, once you look at it. It doesn't move if you push on it. And what's more important, the guitar sounds just fabulous. <laughs> Like most of these guitars that my dad built, it's got a lot of mid-range drive. It's got this really beautiful sound. And uh, this one is really special. It's one of the few he ever made out of Brazilian rosewood instead of Indian. And he built this guitar out of it. You can see the back. Well, you can see me, the computer shining off the back anyway. There you go. Um, it's got a different kind of... Uh, interruption there had a uh, different kind of finger rest on it this is a uh, pick guard made of uh, perloid which some of the older Gibsons had things like that and it's got the same sort of perloid truss rod cover like I said it's a nice playing guitar nice sounding guitar got a good neck on it mahogany neck you can see the pictures, I don't know if you can see it here. But that is mahogany, not rosewood, which the back and the rims are. Got this nice white binding on it. It's got an atypically shaped uh, bridge on it, but it's cool. I don't think it hurts anything sound wise. <laughs> Anyway, I wanted everybody to be able to hear how it sounds because it is for sale. Oh, it's got some nice things, too. It's got original Gibson Grover tuners on it. Those are vintage. You'll note, too, that where it says Jubal on the peg head, that is Mother of Pearl, real Mother of Pearl. That's not a, the decal, which we normally use. There's nothing wrong with the decal, but this is fancier. And uh, like I said, it's just a nice sounding guitar. One little niggle on the top. Well, you know, that doesn't hurt the sound. And if you don't look at it close, you don't see it's there. And this guitar is $5,000. And that sounds like a lot of money, and it is. And the wood in it is worth $5,000. The man who owns this wants that for it. It's worth more, really. So it's, in a manner of speaking, it's a steal. If you can call spending $5,000 on a guitar a steal. Um, anyway, we would like to uh, get this into the hands of a good player so that a good player can enjoy it and do with it what it's supposed to do entertain people and entertain the player instead of sitting, hanging up here on the wall where it's beautiful and i like seeing it but yeah it'd be better for somebody to have it so anyways that's the guitar come by aaron's music service here in uh, vicksburg michigan and i'm turning off the thing that's why i look funny see see the hand <laughs>